Rough Night is the directional debut of Broad City director slash writer Lucia Ariello and follows a bachelorette party that goes wrong after a male stripper is killed. Now, I'll admit I've only really seen a little bit of Broad City but I've heard a lot about the talent involved and the acclaim that the show has received and while the trailers hadn't really done much for me, I still went into Rough Night optimistic. And I'll admit, I enjoyed it a lot more than I thought I would. It's not perfect, but I laughed more than I actually thought I was going to. The film is uneven and there are parts where jokes don't land, but for the most part, when the girls consisting of Scarlett Johansson, Kate McKinnon, Gillian Bell, Ilona Glazer, and Zoe Kravitz are on screen, the movie works. Scarlett is probably the only one out of the group I felt was off, as if the film would be fine with anyone else, but the girls make you believe they are all best friends that have known each other for many, many years. Kate McKinnon really shone here for me. She was absolutely hilarious and probably one of the few Americans who can get an Aussie accent pretty damn right. The movie here follows the likes of films like The Hangover and Weekend at Bernie's and can get a bit predictable towards the end. I enjoyed most of the time I had with the film. Jokes with the fiance Peter can fall flat after the first few jokes sort of land and he has probably the least interesting storyline in the film. Ty Burrell and Demi Moore pop up and they are absolutely hilarious and I kind of wish those guys had a little bit more screen time in the film because I would have loved to have seen what more they could have done with those characters. How the Dead Stripper storyline wraps up is a little weak and a little bit too obvious. It's just not quite as satisfying as it could have been. But ultimately, I laughed a lot more than I thought I would. The friends I went with were both women, and they laughed a fair bit and had a genuinely fun time watching the film. It's definitely not perfect considering the talent that's involved with the film, but I would definitely recommend it to anyone wanting to laugh, maybe to go during a matinee session or something. So, Rough Night gets a 6.5 out of 10 from me. If you like this review, do remember to hit the thumbs up button, give it a like, and don't forget to leave a comment down below in the comment section. If you want to subscribe to the channel, do hit the subscribe subscribe button and press the little bell next to it that way you'll be notified when the Mono Report uploads new videos and don't forget to also follow the Mono Report on Facebook and Twitter at the Mono Report. Thank you so much guys. Don't forget to stay right here for your Mono Fix. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.